Peace. This is Gerard Anthony, and you're here at Richmond, Virginia's premier first Saturday event, Saturday Soul Social, right here in the historic Hippodrome Theater, Richmond, Virginia, Jackson Ward, and it's March 1st, 2014. We're here with our featured artists all the way from ATL, Atlanta, Mr. Heston. How are you doing, Heston? I'm good. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Thank you for being here, brother. Heston just put on a show uh, that will definitely go down in Hippodrome history. Um, just wanted to spend a few moments and talk about the things that he's been doing, which has been a lot. You've yeah. been up to a lot. Yeah. You know, so let's talk about you know, the new project, Love Junkie. Yeah. Love Junkie is the new album. What's the, what is the, the, the premise, the story behind this project? Love Junkie is basically the story of good love bad love how that whole thing relationships you know for me it's like i'm a singer songwriter first so it comes from guitar and vocals mm -hmm. but it's just really my life experience and the relationships that i've i've been in good or bad absolutely. yeah absolutely and this is your fourth album yeah, it's my uh, third full length but fourth project i had an ep which came out in 2003 which was my first first project and then three full length albums um storyteller warm human cold world and this new album love junkie now i always like to ask you know as an artist myself you know how do you stay motivated to continue to write and produce new material well for me man some people some people do music i have i need music like all jokes aside i have to have it um, when I was 20, I had a girl tell me, make a choice between music and, 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 and her. And it's such an easy thing for me because I told her, I was like, if I didn't have music, you probably wouldn't like me because I'm, I'd be like a crackhead in the corner. Like I really need music. So for me, it's like my motivation never dies. I'm always like I was telling somebody the other day, the music keeps coming. It's almost like, I know it's a gift. It's been a blessing. And it's like, I have to use it because it just keeps coming. I don't even ask for it, but the songs just keep coming. So I just, I got to kick them back out. Like an antenna. Pretty much. See, <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. And uh, I know, you know, coming from Dominica, yeah. you know, you grew up listening to a lot of different styles. As a matter of fact, your, your style is called world soul music. Yeah. So how did you develop that sound and who are some of your key influences in uh, developing the Heston sound? Well, like I said, there was a station called DBS Radio. You'd hear Nat King Cold, you'd hear the Bee Gees, Dolly Parton, Michael Jackson, Bob Marley, all back to back on the same station. So it's almost like I got, you know, Boy George, Comic Come on, come on, come on, you know that song. I mean, all those on one station. So I think I just regurgitated all that I've heard and took, and that's what today is Heston music. There you go. Yeah. There you go. And speaking of world soul music, you've been uh, going around the world uh, lately. You've been uh, to Australia, just came off tour there. And uh, we're happy to have you in Richmond, Virginia, as your first show back in the States. Yes, yes. yes. And um, tell us, where are you going to be going next? What does the rest of the year look like for Heston? Well, I have a few dates in the U.S., and then I'm heading to uh, Europe for a, I believe, an eight-city acoustic tour. So it's just acoustic and vocals, which is empty. I can express there's not too much sound behind just me and the guitar. And then um, I'm happy to do the Jazz Cafe in London. Finally, it's just a venue that I've always wanted to play. Uh, you know, supported all my friends that have played there, but I'm, I'm, I've never played there before. So uh, on the 27th of April, I'm doing the Jazz Cafe in London, full concert, like I did here tonight. Um, and then the rest of the tour throughout Europe is uh, acoustic dates. Wonderful. Major moves. Major, major moves. When people want to keep up with you, you know, where do they need to go? What's the website? You know, how can they get the links? How can they buy the music to find out more about Heston Music? Uh, HestonMusic.com. You can find all the tour dates, some free downloads, all the albums available, new videos. I just shot a, a video for the single that actually got the album to number one on, on the soul charts in Europe called Resign to You. So we're going to launch that by the 15th of March. Um, but... If you want a physical copy of the album, CD Baby is the best place, or you can get it off of Heston Music. Facebook, it's Heston's Love Junkies, um, or Heston Music, or Heston Francis. There's a few pages. But, um, but you know, everywhere, iTunes, the music, is, it's available. So it's just HestonMusic.com, and any other link that you need is on the website. Yeah. 
or go to one of the shows. Please. Then you can get a signed picture. Yes. Ho she bang like all the line of people were tonight, you know. Right, that's right. Thank you once again for being here. Y'all make sure y'all check out HestonMusic.com and y'all stay tuned with Saturday Soul Social every first Saturday right here in Richmond, Virginia, Historic Hippodrome Theater, 528 North 2nd Street in Jackson Ward. Peace. <laughs> Marvin and Stevie and Aretha Franklin Donnie Hathaway her friend and fire they paved my way see I've been doing music When I was a baby, I used to go crazy Watching Michael Jackson on my black and white TV Gospel songs from Mal Green, ladies crazy over Marvin Tell me what would I give to share that spotlight with him When I was age 10 Thank you.